Hey everyone, and welcome to my third installment on how to create a Minecraft server. So in this episode, I'm going to show you really quick how to change your IP so that it's words and not numbers. It's really easy. Um, yeah, so let's just jump into it. So the first link is going to be what's my IP. We used it in the last video, and it's pretty handy. So uh, yeah, just copy your IP. And we want to go to this website called freedns.afraid.org. It's really cool. I love it. It uh, it has. It's a service where you usually have to pay, but you don't have to pay. So it's awesome. Uh, yeah. So you just sign up and then go to subdomains, and you'll be presented with this. And all you have to do is type in whatever you want in this subdomain box uh, and then choose one of the different uh, domains and paste your uh, IP in the destination box and you will it's really easy you just uh, your players will just type in delatora.moo.com and they can connect to your server as long as you port forward correctly, which was in my last video. Yeah, so just hit save, and then 10 minutes later, your new IP will be this. And players will very easily connect. So the second thing I'm going to show in this video is uh, f file hosting. So you can host your files online in the cloud and access them from mobile devices or any other computer that has internet connection you just have to go to their website and sign in and you have access to all your files you also can share folders um, with friends so if you have a co-owner uh, you all you have to do is share them share the Dropbox folder with them and they can have all at all the access to the files so um, yeah, so as I said, it's called Dropbox. A lot of you have probably heard of it. Uh, you just have to download Dropbox, which will be on the screen right now. The download link will be on the screen right now. And you just download it, sign up, and once you have it downloaded, just drag and drop your server folder into Dropbox. And I won't do it because I already did. It's awesome. Uh, they Dropbox gives you two gigabytes for free, and that's really all you need. So, yeah, that's about it for this video. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more videos from me, hit the subscribe button. I'm planning on doing some plugin reviews real soon here, and yeah, if you like this, hit the thumbs up, and I will catch you guys later. See ya.